Joanne Claudia Robinson, also known as Jojo Robinson, is a reality TV star of the Real Housewives of Durban. She makes a lot of her personal money from selling paintings and doing other artworks to the elite. She also does photography and is a tattoo fanatic. She loves being in the wildlife. She has become a brand ambassador for Carlton Hair SA and Lush Boutique SA and that's where she also gets other personal bags. She has been married twice. She has stated that she left her first marriage because he abused her physically, mentally, emotionally and financially. She stated that she had to be the breadwinner while he did nothing but waste all the resources that she would bring to the table. She then got married to Calvin Robinson who is a famous former kickboxing and martial artist. He owns several businesses thus his wealth is quite vast jojo and calvin met on facebook they dated for two years then in 2014 they got married they have a son called roko robinson together now from paying all the bills in her first marriage to being a true definition of a housewife someone who's constantly spoiled with luxurious gifts and one can see that she does live the true definition of a soft life she is living a privileged life now from the little update from jojo we all know that jojo did not come from privilege in her first marriage she was basically living paycheck to paycheck so her newfound form of wealth is something that she acquired and not something that she was born with however in the season two season of the real housewives of durban we do see that jojo is quite classist which is kind of weird because the whole point of her getting on the reality tv show was basically to uplift women which were in previous situations like this but how are you going to uplift them when you're constantly looking down on people you view are lower than you i didn't like the way she treated mabusi so mabusi was someone who was a friend to the show in season one and season two and i feel like because mabusi was the one who didn't have much status unlike the other women and just because of the way she was speaking jojo decided to just treat her terrible i also kind of feel like she had racist tendencies just because a white person hangs around with a lot of black people and tries to say a few clicks doesn't mean now they are not racist i'm not saying she's racist i'm just saying that she did come off quite racist in the first few episodes that she was engaging especially when she was engaging with mabusi again i don't know whether she just didn't like mabusi or what the story was but she definitely did give those two vibes from me anyway we've come to the end of today's video please don't forget to hit and like and subscribe Till next time, bye.